Hi everyone, so welcome back to my every six months-ish NCT photo card collection video. I'd honestly been putting off filming this because I knew it was going to take me a while to go through everything. And I've also been debating if I should talk through the video or just kind of flip through it with music playing. Um, just because, I don't know, I feel like I'm saying the same things and you guys are seeing a lot of the same stuff, but I guess for people that haven't seen my other videos, um, I will talk some. So I'm gonna start where I usually do with my postcard binder. And just for some people that haven't seen any of my other collection videos, I do collect the whole group for NCT. Um, mainly for album photo cards, but there are also other non-album cards and things that I like to collect and it's just kind of what I choose to collect. Um, there's no real like set rules like I only collect such and such or not anything else. Um, and my bias in the group is Doyoung. He is my number one person in K-pop. Um, so I try to collect everything that I can for him. Um, obviously there are things that I don't have which are just too hard to find or too expensive. But yeah, I'm gonna start with my postcard binder and this one for sure. I'm not gonna talk much because it honestly hasn't changed, um, mostly because I'm in the dilemma of needing a new postcard binder and I really don't want to start a new binder because I have so many binders for NCT already, but I feel like this is kind of inevitable, especially because I usually like collecting the postcard sets. Um, but yeah, I don't even know if there's, there's hardly anything new in here from the last update. Um, so I'm just going to flip through this. It's in chronological order and I keep the members in age order. And I'm sorry for any of the slight glare that's going to happen. So for anybody wondering where I got these sets, um, I got them from Great Music CD and I've been collecting NCT since 2016 so that's why it's been easy for me, it was easy for me to get them. I do not have all the chewing gum cards because I did not buy the set when it came out. Um, I was more like focused on 127. But yeah, that's the same for my photo cards. Um, it's you know, been a lot easier for me because I've been collecting the cards as they came out and the NCT photo card, you know, market prices weren't always this ridiculous. Um, so I, yeah, it would be very hard if I like just now had decided to like try and collect everything for NCT. I also don't have the full Wee Young set, which I'm very sad about. I wish I had bought that when it was available.
I don't know why I still have these in this weird order, like on my channels is way up there. Um, anyway. Yeah, so I think these might be the only new things that I put in this binder as well as oh, just a random page, um, as well as 127's Season's Greetings um, postcards for this year. And then like I do obviously also have Dreams and Wavies, but I just don't think they're gonna fit in here. And I also wanted to show a couple other things that I have. Um, so I do have like the Nature Republic postcard books. I believe I showed this one in a haul that I did, um, but I haven't torn these out because I've actually just been displaying it on my shelf. So I'm not sure if I want to um, tear them out. I thought about buying like another doyoung just to have in my binder, but I don't know. Um, But yeah, I do have that one, and then I have the second one as well. And this one especially, I don't know if I want to tear out because Marks is literally just like the backing piece. So I don't know. <laughs> um, and then I also have, uh, this is Ten's postcard book thing that you got with his um, photo book. And yeah, I haven't torn these out either, but... Um, I do have those. And I think there's also some other postcard sets like from last year's Seasons Greetings. Like for Dream, well for all the units that I don't have in any of my binders. Um, yeah, I don't know really what I'm going to do going forward. Um, you can probably tell that I'm missing like some recent postcard sets as well. Like dreams a recent postcard set and then i think there's a super m one as well and wavy um for their most recent comebacks but yeah i'm not really sure um what i'm gonna do regarding collecting postcards i think i said this in my last update too um but yeah we'll we'll see what i decide to do throughout the year okay so this is my first photo card binder that has album photo cards as well as the sticker sets I'm not really sure why I decided to put the sticker sets with the album photo cards. Like the more I think about it, the more it doesn't really make sense, but I'm not really going to change it right now because my non album photo card binder is already full. So I don't want to move all of the sticker sets in there as well. Um, so I'll probably just continue doing this. So um, I just have some of my Resonance Part 1 postcards over there that I pulled. Um, so this binder is really full, so I think going forward um, I'm going to have to start a new binder for album cards. So this one will just be Fire Truck through Resonance. So yeah, I'm not really going to talk that much. Um, like I've said before in previous videos, I store everything in chronological order and my cards are in age order. I don't actually have the Wee Young sticker set, and I'm really sad that I didn't buy this when it first came out. Um, I only have Tunla's here.
And I do not have the Superhuman Kino photo card set. I do have four of the members, but when the Superhuman Kino first came out, I didn't have any plans to collect all the members. Um, I didn't really decide that I wanted to collect all the members for the Kino cards until the Kino was pretty much out of print. So yeah, I don't really have any hopes of ever getting all of those cards, but that's okay. I'm still missing one circle card for takeoff. I mentioned this in my last collection video, but I no longer collect the circle cards just because I can't really be bothered to collect them. Um, but I did want to finish one set for each unit, so yeah, I'm just needing Yang Yangs for this. I do keep the circle cards that I pull, I just, yeah, I just can't be bothered to collect them all. I also didn't. Uh, collect the Wee Boom Kino cards either, unfortunately. Um, I wish I had. Uh, these two are the tie press for takeoff. Not takeoff, um, take over the moon, I'm sorry. <laughs> and then for Dreams uh, Japan album, I only collected the selfie set. Um, because they're the easier set to find and I like these more anyway, so Geno's is just the one that I pulled. And yeah, I will say for Kinos, I prioritize 127. Um, so yeah. But I did um, get to collect um, dreams for a reload, which I'm really happy about. So for Resonance, I am collecting all members for all the cards, but I prioritize the selfie cards so I'm not complete on any of the other cards like the yearbook, um, the ID, or the access. So um, here's what I have for the yearbook cards. I'm still missing quite a few. Um, but for the album cards, I'm complete. Minus one card for all of Resonance. So here is part one, the past version. And the future version. Then I have my part one Kino card. So I do have um, one of Taeyong's. I can't remember if it's his past or future. Um, but yeah, these are a mix of cards that I pulled and some that I bought um, or traded. So yeah, and Taeyong's are with his non album cards. They're not. Um, here with these cards. And then this kind of segues into part two. So these four are ones that I pulled and then I do have um, one of Taeyong's and one of Yuta's coming which will fill up these spots and that's all I really plan to collect as of right now. Um, I might try and get some more in the future. I don't really know. I don't really have any like set goals or plans for that. And then we have part two, the departure version. I love this set so much. And the Arrival version, um, I also love this set. I just really love the part two cards. So yeah, this Geno is the one card that I'm missing um, for the Resonance like selfie cards anyway. And then these are just the, ac um, the ID cards that I pulled and then the same for the access cards. I haven't really started working on these yet. Um, and then I have the sticker set. And that's it for this binder. So this is my non-album photo card binder. Um, this is the binder that I've had the longest. Um, you would have seen this in like all of my collection videos. Um, 
from the very beginning almost, but yeah. So on the front here I have Doyoung's uh, Regulate Binder Index. This is the first one that they did. Um, I don't really buy all of these just because, I don't know, they don't really like fit on the three ring binders that I have that well. But first up, um, I still have all of my Doyoung non-album cards that like aren't part, part of full sets that I have, so if that makes sense. Um, I don't really know if I should go through every card. I don't think I will, but yeah, this is like his earliest stuff. Um, I can't remember if I had the SM Town Jakarta photo card in my last update. I think I did, but that would be like the newest addition to this page. Um, in this page I have um, a couple empathy and then regular, regular, and regulate. And season's greetings. I think this was what 2019, and then um, Neo City tour. Um, some Japan photo cards, the Japan photo book card, uh, Superhuman. I do have an extra Doyoung if anybody wants to trade for Taeyong, which uh, I don't really think that will happen, but yeah. Um, then this one Lonesome Summer Kit pre order card. I have the with drama one in the full set that I have, and I know there's the 11th Street one, which I could get to go here, but I find that card so ugly because it has that random blue border on the side. And uh, then we have my superhuman page. Uh, this is back to school stuff. I have an extra of his first fan club card, live CD photo card, uh, Japan Arena Tour entrance card. More Seasons Greetings, pre-order cards, uh, Genom photo cards, Winter Fan Meet, and then Japan Fan Club photo card. Uh, this is Neo's own page plus the final round Kinos as well. And this page is kind of random, so the final round holo card, the first Nature Republic card. This is the Precious Moment photo card. Um, AR, Beyond Live, and ID set thing, the brochure card, and then this is his signature back. Um, second fan club photo card. I have the signature um, full set later on. I just kept Doyoung's logo back in here for space reasons. Um, this is Resonance Part 1 page, so I have his Kino cards here. Honestly, this is like Doyoung's, one of his best cards in existence, I think. There's like Japanese collectors that will collect like a full page of the same card, and honestly, I would do that for that card. Um, but this is his tablet photo card, and then the photo cards that came with the postcard um, frame set. And then his holo card, and this is his yearbook collect book card. Um, yeah. And I think the only other card that will go on this page will be the binder card because that is um, from the From Home concept. So that will be part one as well. And then this page uh, will be for part two cards. So I have his Kino cards and then um, an extra of his access card, which I pulled. So they just announced more merch for part two. So I think that'll fill up this page easily. And then these cards will be moved. So this is his second Nature Republic card, which is so cute. Um, and then this is his Hollow Seasons Greetings card from Aladdin. Uh, we just have horizontal cards and fan-made cards. And then I have my Yuta section, which hasn't really changed, um, except I did get his Superhuman Kino, which I'm very happy about. I really like. I really would like to get his um, yearbook collect book card, but I don't know if that'll happen. Uh, then we have my miscellaneous one two seven page. So these are just other cards that I've acquired from um, the one two seven members. So this is the same with Dream. So these are just cards that I've either pulled or bought because I like. Um, 
Yeah. And then wavy. And then I do have Ten's uh, photo book, photo card on the back here. Um, I'll start a new page once I get um, any other wavy miscellaneous cards. Uh, this is 2017 Seasons Greetings at the Paper Toy Set. Some people have asked me if these cards are real. Um, I honestly don't know other than Doyoung and Yuta because I bought their Paper Toy Set. The others, I don't know. I don't really care, honestly. Um, yeah, they could be the fake ones that... I forget who it was that sold them, but uh, it doesn't really matter to me. Uh, then we have my 2018 Empathy Hollow card set, and I'm just missing HN. I can't find him for a good price, so hopefully I can find that. Um, I did, however, complete the Entrance photo card set, which I love. I'm very happy about that. Then we have my page that I did to commemorate the Seven Cents. Um, so these are the SN Town Live uh, photo cards um, for the members that were in the Seven Cents. Well, technically Tail wasn't, but um, it's fine. And then these are the bus photo cards. I did finish this. This was kind of a random set that I decided I'd like to try and complete, and I was able to do that. Um, I also finally completed the um, Japan DVD photo cards. I'm really happy about that. Uh, summer kit pre-order set. Really... I unfortunately did not buy Dream summer kit. Um, I just like didn't have enough money at the time to buy it, but I'm pretty sad that I wasn't able to get that. Um, but we have my Dream Puff photo cards. Uh, back to school kit photo card pre order set. Uh, 127 Fan Club set and Dreams. Uh, D Icon photo card set. Welcome to my playground set. Um, Super M. Extra cards from their first mini album. I really didn't plan to get a full page, but somehow I ended up with all these. Um, the tour cards. Uh, the Dream Show Fortune scratch cards. 2020 Seasons Greetings stuff. Uh, this page, which really makes no sense. Um, I don't know why I collected so many of the AR cards. Like I should have just bought Doyoung's and called it a day, or if anything I should have just collected all 127's. Like, I don't know. Um, I really want Chonla's, but these are pretty hard to find now. But, but I'd really like to have his to fill this page, but yeah. Um, this is the second uh, 127 fan club set, the signature backs. Um, this is Dream Candy Lab. I think this is the second photo card set that they released. I love this Geno card so much. Um, and then the rest of this is literally all Seasons Greetings stuff from this year. So this is K Town for You pre order set for 127 and the Aladdin uh, pre order set. Um, I talked about this in my collective haul for January, which will come out soon, but I found an eBay seller selling the full set of these for a really good price, so I decided to pick them up. This is Dream's uh, K-Town For You pre-order set, and then these are all the cards that you got with the Season's Greetings. I love this one so much, so cute. And the same for Wavy, this is their um, K-Town For You set. And then the cards that you got with the Season's Greetings, which are so superior. Oh my gosh. And then finally, I just have uh, group cards. And then these are some fan-made ones. Um, or unofficial, I should say. 
So yeah, that is everything for this binder, which as you can see is also pretty full. So I do plan to move Dwayong's cards out into his own binder, I think. And I think I'm going to move like all of his one-off postcards and things as well in there to try and create some room in some of my other binders. But yeah, that's it for this one. Okay, so this next binder kind of starts my miscellaneous items. Um, so in here I mostly have photo sets and other official sets, things that come with albums and stuff. Um, so yeah. So for the photo sets, I really just collect 127, uh, mostly because that's the unit that Doyoung is in and I just find it to be like more worth my money to buy the full set rather than just buy Doyoung's. So yes. And I usually prefer to buy the postcard sets for the other units. Uh, not that I don't like the photo sets, but... So I don't really think that much has been added to this binder since the last update I did. I'm just going to try and go through it quickly. And some of Doyoung's specific things, like his standees and stuff, I have started moving um, with his other stuff in my other binder because eventually, like I said, I want to move all of his stuff to his own binder. But yeah, um, these are Ten's photos from his photo book. These might be the only new things in here from postcards and then more 10 photo book stuff. This, um, so this is 127 postcards for their season's greetings um, and I cannot find where I put tails. Like I know I got it because I unboxed it and it was definitely there but I don't know where I put him so he's like got to be somewhere in my apartment though. why these are back here but um, yeah so that's everything for this binder so this is the last binder minus my A4 folders um, this has like more um, miscellaneous items so I have some dialing specific things at the front Again, I don't really know if I've added much to this binder since my last update, so... I really need to like rearrange everything in here though, it's just kind of a mess in here. Still looking for doyongs of this if anybody wants to trade any of these three for his.
And then here's where I keep all the circle cards and other things. Like I have some of the ID cards back here just because I didn't really want to collect those. Um, and then I have Do Young's superhuman divider thing. And then this is all unofficial slash fan made cards. Um, I used to like really collect the yes cards, but I just don't really see them like being sold anymore. I don't know. Um, and then these as well, I pretty much stopped buying when the seller stopped offering K packet shipping due to COVID. So. Yeah, I haven't really bought any of these. Um, I know I could join group orders, but I don't know. I haven't, so. And then this is official, so it should be before this stuff, but Doyoung's D icon thing. And then all of my Doyoung fan made stuff. is it for this binder. So lastly I have my three A4 folders and these are honestly like 95% Seasons Greetings stuff which uh, I kind of wish I would stop doing because I keep having to buy more of these. Um, but the first one I have is my Doyoung specific one and it's kind of cut off at the top. I'm sorry about that. Um, but I have all of his A4 photos minus the Limitless one. I still have Yuta's fire truck folder in here as a placeholder. Um, I just like can't find it being sold. This is his Empathy High Touch poster. These are SM Town Museum prints. And yeah, I do have his part two Residence one on the way, um, so I'm literally not going to have any pages left in this. So this is my first um, other member one. chain and then pretty much just season's greetings or summer kit stuff now. And I've said it before but I'll say it again in this video. I just wish these were like actually A4 sized um, because they're not. Like they would fit in the normal one pocket pages, like ultra pro ones. Um, is a Japan elder for wiki wiki. <laughs> and then this is my second one.
is from the Wavy photo book. And these are also from the um, Wavy photo book, the member ones. Yeah, that is everything for this binder. So that actually concludes my NCT collection update video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, again, if you have any questions, feel free to ask them down in the comments below and I'll see you next time.